Hey guys, and today we have another pro and cons of Mega Walls classes. It's a series I'm doing where I go through all the best bits of a class and I also go through kind of the negative things of the class. Last time I did one was the skeleton, but I'm going to do it the way that I the class reviews, just the normal class reviews. So I'm going to go home and do the Enderman this time. So this is the pro and cons of the Enderman class. I hope you enjoy it and here it comes. So I have not upgraded anything, bear that in mind. This is just the default things and I spawn with a one sword, chain boots of feather falling one, two stake and because I'm VIP, a pickaxe. First pro we're going through is that if you mine or a wood you have a 10% chance to mine another block next to it. So here, as I mine this wood, the one next to it also goes and I can pick that up as like I've just mined it. This also works with coal, iron and stone. So as you can see here, I am just doing it. And if you upgrade that, then it'll happen very often like it does here. This is very good. So the next pro is something that every everyone likes is that you can teleport. So this helps in battle and you can teleport 10 blocks and also give 5 seconds of speed. This is very good. So if that enemy is outside of that radius then it won't, you won't be able to teleport to him. But in the video I get this guy as he goes over the wall as I could catch up to him and I kill him right here he is dead so if your enemy is on low health and trying to run away this skill helps a lot as you can just teleport to him and give him a couple more hits and that could just kill him like it does for me here so you can also get over walls if there's a guy on the wall you can just teleport up to there Kill the guy, get over the wall, and go and kill the weaver if you want. Well, yeah, you can do what you want. So, you won't always kill him, because because the person could be on a lot of health when you teleport, a lot of health when you teleport to him. But it's always good to use it anyway. So now we're going to move to the other pros. There is a 5% chance that you keep your inventory. There is a 4% chance that you gain knockback resistance for 5 seconds when you get hit by enemies. And yeah, that is pretty much all of the pros. I've probably missed out a couple. But now we're going to move on to the cons. Firstly, there's, you only teleport 10 blocks if there is a person within that 10 blocks. That isn't a lot, but it's still that can be upgraded to quite a lot. Also... The, you don't spawn with a lot of stuff, it won't help you in battle the stuff you spawn with first. And also the 5% chance to keep your inventory and the 4% chance to gain knockback resistance. That they are really small numbers and that will happen probably once every every like five games or so. It's really rare that, that stuff will happen, but that can be can be upgraded a lot. So anyway, that was the pro and cons of the Enderman class and yeah see you in a sec so yeah guys I hope you enjoyed this video I know it was not as long as the skeleton but I didn't really find a lot of things about the Enderman class because I've not really upgraded it fully I've only got the first ones I've not upgraded anything because I really want to save up for like one of these it's going to take absolutely ages but yeah, if we're, in, we're nowhere near on there. <laughs> but yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed it anyway. If you liked it, give it a like, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in my next video. So goodbye.